Okay, so I wanted to put this video together to just show you a little workaround I found for Google Slides. Um, one of the things that I found quite irritating about Google Slides is this film strip on the left. On a really big screen, it's not too big of a problem, but when you're presenting in Google Meet, it takes up quite a bit of space. Um, and for me, it gets in the way. There, I really don't need that to be there. So I found a way to just get rid of it. Uh, so what you do is you go to the three dots in the top right part of your screen, and you go to More Tools and Developer Tools. And this should bring up a horrible looking bunch of code. Okay, uh, please don't worry that you can make a big mistake here because any changes you make here are actually very temporary. Uh, if you do get rid of something you shouldn't have, just hit the refresh button and it will pop back up. Uh, so what we're looking for, if you scroll down, you should eventually come to a little thing saying div id docs editor container. Okay. And you'll notice it highlights the whole middle part of the, the, the presentation screen. Uh, when you get to that, you need to click the triangle, click the triangle, click the triangle, click the triangle, click the triangle until you get film strip. Uh, and notice it highlights that film strip. So click on that and then hit delete. And that's it. The film strip has gone. And now the slide takes up a much wider space. You can make even more space by getting rid of the menu and then hitting the F11 button so that it takes up the full screen. And the real benefit of this over using the present button is you've still got your tools. So you can add text, you can make links between things. So this is the major advantage over hitting the present button because the present button essentially means that you can't do anything. You can't make any changes to the slide. Um, so I think this is really useful, particularly for Google Meet present presentations. Uh, so thanks, and I hope you found that useful.